guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are working with Paracord. Uh, those of you that have been following on the Instagram have seen that we have started producing a new item, and that item being uh, gunslings. Uh, we make gunslings that can be used as two point or one point, um, and they're universal. So we have a pretty high demand already uh, once people have started seeing them we've been getting messages and um, you know, others sharing uh, our product and we now have about 15 people that want gunslings and that number is growing that's uh, pretty much happened within the last week so I am trying to work on as many as possible um, Jackie just picked up four uh, big rolls of a thousand foot paracord in black tan brown and um, camouflage that was the other one camouflage so uh, tonight, I am working on a snake knot uh, paracord sling, and I am on the second layer uh, with the snake knot one. Um, you could do one layer, which looks like this, And then um, you'd go through and you'd weave another layer across, which makes it uh, pretty thick and strong. And uh, anyway, you don't want this thinner strap on your shoulder and that uh, this gives it a little more width and a bit more padding. So I'm going through and doing the second weave and um, trying to get this one done and then I've got another one that I'm going to be doing that takes a bit more time to do and I need to practice it. Um, last time I made one it took about three hours so I'm hoping to cut that down in half um, but it uses um, 70, 75 feet of uh, cord, and this uses about 55 to 60 feet of cord. So um, I usually, I cut off about 60 feet, and I usually have, oh, a couple lengths of uh, 18 inches or so. So... It's around 50, 55 feet. Uh, as we get making these, I'll be able to um, get a little bit better estimates and not have to waste quite so much. The good thing is, is we make bracelets in that, so these pieces will get used. So that's always good. And we will be putting these up on the... Um, website. Uh, my computer has been down. Um, in fact, I actually had to buy a new computer. I'm waiting on it to come in. Um, but I have not been able to get on to the website and work on, on it. Um, I can get on on Jackie's computer. Problem is, is I'm going to have to reset the password because I can't remember the password. I have it so it would automatically um, log me in. Probably not the best thing. I need to figure some something out for passwords. So many passwords you gotta remember. Anyway, so this is the cool thing. I've done several of these now, and Jackie and I have come down to this. So these are the clips. As you can see, they're spring-loaded. They're nice, powder-coated. Um, metal clips they have a hole here and that hole allows for the other clip to come around 
and clip in. So you go from a uh, two point to a single point. Um, the one thing I do find a little bit weird about these, it, it works and everything, um, it does kind of tend to turn the, you kind of get a little bit of a twist in the um, um, sling, but um, I've had a few people try them out, try them on, and uh, they say it, it doesn't it doesn't really matter uh, that it's usable, it's sturdy. Um, so the few people that uh, I have allowed to um, promote, and I've uh, uh, they have some of our first line of product. Uh, we've been getting good reviews and uh, good feedback from them. A few things we're going to change. Like I said in the beginning, uh, length is going to be one. Uh, that was one thing that I did not take into account. I just was going off of um, <clears throat> information that I have uh, pulled from other sources, saying the standard um, sling was uh, ranged adjustable range from 36 to 48. I did later find some more uh, information saying that... Um, the adjustable ones can uh, be made up to 60 inches uh, to incorporate um, things like clothing, uh, more barrel-chested men. Um, I also did not take into account uh, plate carriers. So um, someone that's small and, um, and that can, can use these with a plate uh, carrier. If you are bulkier and more barrel-chested like I am, um, you are not going to be able to use these uh, first round of slings we're putting out with a uh, plate carrier. So that being said, like I said, we're going to be making uh, our second round. We will be making uh, some longer ones. And that length will be added on to the one-inch um, nylon strap. The braid and and that will stay the same, uh, same length, and we'll just add it on to the nylon. Um, but yeah, so let me show you. I have a couple of finished products I can show you real quick. All right, so I had a few more, but um, they. They're gone. <laughs> They're being used. Uh, they are in, in use with their new owners. Uh, so right now, one I'm making, and then two others that I have already made. And then I have the other one, which will be a thicker, it's a thicker braid, um, and it'll be really nice. But these are the ones that I have made. This is finished product. This, this is... Um, cinched all the way down so this is about 36 inches um, the back of the uh, weave as you can see it's thicker so it gives you some nice padding and then this is the front of the weave because um, I wound it up it's kind of once in use it kind of breaks itself in but it's been wound up so it's kind of got some kinks in that in it but this is what it looks like and then we've got ionized or iodized um, metal sliders um, the first one I made was with plastic and I just I, I didn't like it it felt cheap um, I didn't feel comfortable uh, selling a product like that so we went with uh, these um, these clips also these took a while to get in um, I have ordered I need to make another order in fact make sure that um, once I start putting the, the ones out that I've made I can start getting these in for the next round but all these um, are um, 
metal. They're durable. Um, I'm super happy with it. And those uh, customers that have already um, purchased from us uh, have been super happy with it as well. And then it is also stitched. Nice. Uh, Jackie does that for me. And uh, yeah, so nice one inch webbing, nice, thick, good stuff. Not the cheap, thin crap. Uh, all metal hardware and then 550 cord. So that's that one. And then I have a camouflage and tan. Same thing. So the colors, I don't know if I'm gonna be making more of this. Um, I might have enough to make one more. The colors we're going to be going with, uh, just because they're what we have, and it was uh, we got it on a on a pretty good deal. So we'll we'll have design like this, a tan and camouflaged. We'll have uh, black and brown, and then we'll have a. Uh, black and camouflage and I might kind of alternate some of those colors to have a few different uh, varieties but ultimately we'll probably have between four and six different variations of it and then we will have the snake knot and then we'll have the other one it's called the covenant oath knot and the once I get them up on the um, website, they will be labeled and I will make it super easy for everyone so that you don't have to go through uh, a drop down list to choose. Each of these colors, color variations will have their own item. So you can literally go in and check, you know, click uh, order and you know, put in your information and everything. You won't have to drop any any menu down and change colors and stuff like that. Um, we're just gonna try and stay as basic as possible. Um, it's easiest for us, makes it easy for you guys, and um, we'll get those out and going. Hopefully I can get that. Once the computer, new computer gets in, I will get them up on the internet. <laughs>